Hi, my friends. Sam Villa. Welcome to Sam's Hair Hacks. It's all about tips, tricks, and ideas that you can use behind the chair. And then once again, product is not an option, it's a necessity. Today's product of choice is Guts 10, a volumizing spray foam. Think about targeted root lift. This is your product of choice. It controls frizz and flyaways and gives you root volume like no other. So it's all about using it in a different way. So let's use it in a way where we create a very sleek look, a wet look, if you will. So I've gone through and I've taken a section. So what I want to do on the side area is I've taken a diagonal back section so some of this hair will overlap that when I'm done. I've taken diagonal forward sections working with my Guts 10. Now I want you to use more product than you think you should. So let's go with a comb and we're going to come through, take a diagonal forward section. It's going to make it easier for me to take this in the direction that I want to take that. Now we're going to come through with our Guts 10. Now when I apply Guts 10, watch how much I'm using and I'm going right at that base. Right at that base and then just an S pattern. So make it snow. Really make it snow. Now come through with a fine tooth comb. I like to work with a tail comb. And the reason being is you're going to use the tail comb to actually slick this down. So you've got that tail comb. Now follow with your hand and the tail comb. So you get this really almost like latex kind of feeling with the idea. Now we come through take another diagonal forward section and bring it back. So imagine this, you could do this to the entire front on both sides. Today we're just gonna go for a little bit more of a asymmetrical type of finish by going just on one side. Okay, last section. Working at that base. More product than what you actually think. So think about this. With Sam's Hair Hacks, we're talking about using product in different ways and working with ideas and ways that you can create the fabric that we call hair and mold it in different ideas and different finishes. Now once I've got that, now watch me just finish this with the tail of my comb so I get that really sleek kind of latex feel to that. Now we don't finish here. Now we're going to work with a blow dryer and a diffuser and we're actually going to go in now and just make this really solid so that it stays there. So a small amount of heat. You're not gonna lose that high shine effect with the Guts 10. But what I wanna do is dry it so that it stays exactly where I want it. Okay. Okay. Nice, once we've got that, I release the back of that. But before I release the back of that, take a small grip right behind the ear. I'm just going to take a small grip and I'm just going to apply that right here. Why, Sam? You see, I didn't have to use any hairpins or grips here. But here I've got so much hair, I wanted just this hair to stay really nice and close to the head. So you're placing your grip right in this area here. So that's really important. Now, release this hair and watch this hair come over that so you get this type of feeling. Now remember, you could do both sides. You could do maybe just the front way over to one side. Your creative choice. Thanks for watching Sam's Hair Hacks, and I'll see you next time for the next hack. Want more hacks, my friends? Be sure to check out Sam's Corner on the new Redkin Break Room. If you love to learn, be sure to follow at Redkin Fifth Ave on Instagram for more hacks and tricks from me and Redkin to you.